Then it goes on. It says he wraps himself in light as with a garment. You're dealing with imagery, beautiful imagery. Um, light suggests many blessings, life, salvation, joy, righteousness, pleasure. It's all found in him. But it also is a setup for the gospel of John where this great creator enters our history and at one point says, and I'm the light of the world. And whoever follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. When you hold those two things together, what you're meant to do, you're meant to read Psalm 104, and where it says, you know, you have this great God who wraps himself in light. Then join the dot to Jesus and say, this God is that Jesus. This God here is that Jesus. Or if you start at the New Testament, this Jesus, he's that God. It absolutely stops you in your tracks.